It's Sunbelt semifinal Saturday from Coastal Carolina University in Springsbrook Stadium. And the first of two semifinals today as the number six seed Troy Trojans take on the number two seed and East Division champion Georgia Southern Eagles. 32 pitches already in the inning for Witcher. And called strike three. 1 0, there he goes. Throw down, and he is going to be out. Strike from Avant, 2 6. Mosley thrown out, trying to swipe second. And that ends the third inning. Towards the hole, stopped by Frederick, throw across the diamond, gets away from the first baseman, Goodwin. Here comes Martin. He will score, and Georgia Southern has the first lead of the game. Again, it was that tough hop way out in front of the first baseman, Goodwin. It's a harder play than the short pick. You can usually handle the short pick. You're right. That one that's out there about eight feet makes it very difficult. He's so intense back there and so good at his work. Up the middle, Thompson gets to it, spins and throws and got him. Two balls and two strikes to Sinkfield. Right side of the infield and Swan gets over there and covers it well and Owens does his job too, one out. To be careful with the breaking ball here if you throw it in the dirt and it gets by. So you've made him look bad on two fastballs. See if you go back to it again. He does, and strikes out Sinkfield on three pitches. All Sunbelt second team shortstop, right back to the pitcher. Nick Jones fires, and Georgia Southern will play in the championship game for the third time in four years. You and I talked two days ago how important pitching staffs would be when it came to the semifinal round. What did you see from your two pitchers today, especially to close out with Nick the way that he did? Well, Tyler Owens did a great job. You know, he just kept battling and kept putting up zeros for us. And uh, Nick Jones was uh, unbelievable out of the bullpen. And uh, they got the leadoff man on there in the ninth. He did a good job of, of keeping his poise and making some pitches when he needed to. And, and hats off to Troy. You know, their guys pitched uh, equally as well. Witcher was really good. Uh, Hickson behind him. We really had a hard time getting anything going. You know, these things don't always go like you think they would. When you get deep in a tournament, you expect to see more scoring, but there was good pitching on both sides in that ball game. Georgia Southern heads back to the championship game, a place that you all have been before but have not won. What do you all need to do this time around to get that victory? Well, we got to continue to pitch. Obviously, I think it always starts on the mound. you got to pitch, play defense, and offensively, it's a matter of doing the little things, being able to execute. When you get runners to third with less than two outs and you have opportunities to score, you got to get them in. Uh, you got to get that big two out hit. You know, those are the things that's usually the recipe for success, whether it's tournament baseball or, or really any day you come to the ballpark. And what do you think about your team? They're having some fun in the dugout, having some fun behind you. What does it mean to have let them have a little fun? Well, you know, uh, these guys, they love being around each other. They have all year, you know, whether it's on the field, in the weight room, just hanging out in the clubhouse. So that's that's nothing new for this group.